My pleas for peace have been rejected by calls for violence. From, you know it, Spider-Man. An attack on what was once a destination for enjoyment now stands desecrated and defiled. Our cherished Coney Island was victim to a free-for-all brawl destroying iconic attractions and history itself. Some of my fondest memories were at Coney Island. My father used to buy me the nickel pop and hot dog combo, and I, like any self-respecting American, would overindulge. Now, it's all been taken from me. To make matters worse, Spider-Man seems to have brought a new friend along for his night on the town. Just what this city needs. Another vigilante to take the law into their own hands. One person wasn't enough for you to corrupt, Spider-Man. You need two acolytes to do your bidding? Add to the pile of unpleasantness the hunters and reformed criminal Lonnie Lincoln, a.k.a. Tombstone, and you have a recipe for the ruination of any normal person just trying to have a night out. These hunters are clearly after the Spider-Man and any of their accomplices. They're as much a blight on this city. Getting in the hang of this thing. I think I can pull that steam pipe up. out my stash at the old radio station. I was wondering where I was. That station was the hottest ticket in Brooklyn for up-and-coming hip-hop artists back in the day. You and Pops get any airtime? We got close, but they bumped us last minute for this next-level group out of Staten Island. I still got your beats if you want them. <laughs> NYC ain't ready for a prowler spotty mixtape. Take it easy, kid. 